Got a minute to learn something new about smartwatches? Just a reminder, we have a whole playlist of these tips which you can reach at this address and a lot of goodies are waiting for you in a Google Drive at the Smartwatch Resource Center here. Your one minute begins now. I'm going to show you how to turn your smartwatch into a Wi-Fi hotspot, just like you've done with your phone. First, you have to have a data SIM that you can put in the watch that is compatible with the networks these watches run on. That's the GSM network, means you need AT&T or T-Mobile or a derivative of those networks in the United States. First thing you got to do is take the SIM cover off of the back of the watch, put the SIM in and then turn it on. Once you boot it up, slide over, tap on your settings, go to connect, and from inside connect, Wi-Fi hotspot. You first you want to set it up and put in a password that you're going to be using, save that, and then activate the hotspot. Now your watch will immediately become literally a Wi-Fi hotspot connectable to any other device. From your computer, your tablet, your phone, or even from another watch, you do the standard connection that you would normally do with Wi-Fi, and the device is going to appear in here as an active device, Max Mobile. Simply go in there, put in the password, and you're connected. Word of warning, if you're going to use a watch for a Wi-Fi hotspot, try and get a big, thick, fat battery in it. Or make sure you're plugged in wherever you plug in and have it always connected to an outlet. If you're going to be out and about, get one of those power bricks to power it. Warning, it's going to get hot. So make sure whatever one you're using as a Wi-Fi hotspot, you try to keep it chilled somehow. Keep it cool. Let it touch cold metal. Dissipate the heat. It's going to overheat on you and it's going to drain the battery really fast. Take those precautions and you can have a really fun portable Wi-Fi hotspot with its own SIM card in it. Good to go.